Welcome back to some more Paper Mario Color Splash! I was about to say sticker stuff, but I, if I've been psyoped. Today we're heading, heading to Chateau Chanterelle! Whatever that means. I don't know. I... It's a weird language. I... I don't even know what language it is, but fuck it. Fuck it. Alright, so this is not really a level, more so just a building-ish thing, so... It's the professor's house! Yeah, cool. The professor studies fossils and other radial things. He's known as an old rock in the palace, the power lines of his field. Cool. And there's a color spots around, so let's fix those up right quick. I just hope the inventory problems won't be prevalent this episode as much, because that was fucking annoying last time, let me tell you. Well, whatever, let's meet that prof, dude. Welcome back, professor. I've arranged your blue boxes just the way you like. Oh, you're not a professor. Can I help you? I'm not sure. I think maybe we need to talk to the professor. See, we're looking for missing paint stars, and it's kind of a long story, but we can see one of them from the professor's front yard. Ah, uh, the paint stars are extremely old, because the professor is already interested in very old things. You know, fossils, ruins, stuff like that. Well, and his princess. He's definitely obsessed with his princess. It reminds me, the professor is on a walk in Mondo Woods with princess, but he's been gone so long. I'm actually getting a little worried. Should I do something? Oh, it's a search party. Nah, my first Lisa was correct. I'll just wait passively at the corner and hope for the best. Sounds like a plan. Good luck with that. Oh yeah, god, more, more spots. Well, let's fix those up right away. And this tiny one. Ooh, mushroom. I guess first fix first, let's pipe. At least, uh. Orange one? Okay. Oh, it's easy. If only it was always this easy, huh? Then we'd not be out of a job, but these parts would be extremely short. Where does this lead? To a level we will do probably next episode-ish? Yeah, probably. So for now, let's just head back in and get the other paint star. Because we did here, the professor is in Mondo Woods, so... We probably need a green paint star to get to a green woods part, so, you know, easy. So just head back into the backyard real quick. Oh, some repetition there, that's not good. Alright, uh, yank. So, uh, anything else over here? Oh, that's that, but oh, that's not something we can do yet, so, uh, nope. That just thought it looked suspicious, so my instincts in instantly went off. This is Baby Prince's color palace. The professor insists that I call it that. He's stalked by pay for not saying it. Alright. This is a pretty crap doghouse until you realize we're a paper man living in a paper world. It's pretty clever. Okay, uh... That will put us here. There's two more color spots. I think that should be all of them in this stage. So, yeah, I, I can call it a stage. Don't blame me for that. There we go. That opens up that so we can always go in and out. Cool. Not sure why I'd want to. Well, actually, there is a reason why we'd want to. Because here's the thing. Another one of the rare optional ones. The piggy bank. Oh, what? Oh, fine. Fine. God. And here I thought I was safe. Nope. Oh, God. What are you? A lemon replica. Well, uh, that is tempting. So, I guess we'll do that. Okay, so. No, 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 no. Ah, dang it. There. Yeah. That's what we want to do. We want to make a slope out of that. And there we go. Just go up there. Easy peasy. And we're off.
Right. Now, if my assumption is correct, this should be Mondo Woods. Because otherwise we'd be kind of fucked, wouldn't we? And all the color spots are done. Into Mondo Woods we go. The actual stage of this episode. Look at that, that's quaint. Ah. Fuck me, dude. Fuck me. It's really just one of those episodes, huh? Oh, fine. Oh, fine. You know, you'd think at some point we'd fight enough enemies that it wouldn't be an issue, but... Apparently not. Maybe that's what I get for not donating to the museum, huh? Maybe that's it. Who knows? Who knows? And, uh, anything is picked? Uh, nope. What are you doing here? Saw so Professor walk right past the spot of Princess. Of course, she's so small and quick, it's no wonder she got away. Probably slipped right out of her collar. The Professor chased her, but I didn't see where I often went. I guess we got our lead then, uh... No, it's not. That, that looked like one for a second. Uh, paint that stuff. Ooh, a big jump. Those are quite powerful, but we already saw those uh, in the first episode, so no biggie. Hey, Mario. Is it just me or is there something unusual about this forest? I mean, I can't quite put my hand on it, but... Oh, I just figured it out. Everything's huge! New enemy! Mega Goomba! Yeah! This is kinda scary. Uh, <laughs> these things have a lot of HP and they're ready to kick your fucking ass. They do a shit ton of damage. The big jumps and any big attacks we'll find in this area will be your absolute friend. Otherwise, yeah, you'll be chopping away at the HP quite slowly. I don't think this will be enough anyway, so great. So we'll see them attack. Yeah, 16 blocked. That's 32 unblocked if my math is correct, which it should be. Not good. Not good. I... I'm not gonna risk just using one jump because that would not be good if I did that. Okay, that's fine. Could've risked it, but I'm not gonna. Let me reel. This is too scary. So yeah, that's the gimmick of this whole place. Everything's fucking huge, even the coins. I love how the like, noise, like the coin collecting noise is down pitched. Like, it's kinda cute. This will be our, one of our main sources for big uh, cards for now, for a while. Yeah, first strike doesn't really do much, that's... Uh, what do we do here then? Uh, well, we can always j throw back to replicas if we needed to, which might be an option. I do have a big hammer. So we can try a knee cam as well. But yeah, big cards definitely require more paint for you to use as well, so be careful. Oh, that was good. That was some good damage there. I don't... Yeah, that's not gonna be enough at all. At least some good damage dealt. This is so scary, dude. I should heal. I definitely should heal. Guess we can do this. Should be fine. I hope. Unlike in Sticker Star, there's no actual command for mushrooms this time. They just heal a fixed amount. Goodbye. Some might call this a difficulty spike, but I feel like with 
them giving you a lot of big cards in the stage, it's fine. Like, yeah, it's scary, but that's the joke, I think, so whatever. Another big hammer. And to be fair, they are slow enough that you can avoid them quite easily. If you're not stupid. Alright, we got another big jump and a big hop slipper. Cool. It's gonna be useful. Okay, paint that. Big E-Camera! Cool. Getting all the big cards here. Which is much appreciated because otherwise we'd be fucked. Uh -huh. Okay, here we don't want to go willy-nilly breaking everything just yet. Because, first of all, there's this Goomba here that we should probably just engage. Just to get him out of the way, he's blocking my mojo. Uh, I'll do a big hammer and... What if I were to purchase fast food and disguise it as my own cooking? Would that be enough? No, I don't think it will be, dang it. Oh, especially if I do that. Ah, oh, dang it, dang it, dang it. Well, crap. I guess we're taking the hit. I'm always so close to killing them, though. That's the annoying thing. Like, it's like I feel like I could kill them in one turn, but I'm, I don't want to waste two big cards in one turn, is the thing. Yeah, that's an issue. But whatever. It's fine. you drop that down, dickhead. I get a big jump out of that, sweet. What? What? That's bullshit. I did not... What? Can I only have hidden blocks around? Don't think so, but that's weird. Well, whatever. P repaint it so we can break it. That... Yeah, that that's fucking great. But yeah, at least now we can break all these blocks to reveal a big, long, colorless spot. Woohoo. Also a passageway over there, which I will check out in a mo because right now I want to go to the right first. Really? Just three coins out of that? I would have liked a card. Eh, whatever. It's fine. It's fine, as they say. Alright, we got more big goombas. Let's see if we can't maybe... No, 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 no. Avoid them, question mark. <laughs> okay, fine, 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 I'll kick your ass. Okay. Got a lot of big cards now, we can just do this. Just end it. And actually get a perfect bonus against one of these guys for once. I hope. Uh, I don't... Uh, maybe. Actually, no. Really? That's surprising. And a bit worrying, whatever. I'm gonna pop another mushroom because my HP is getting a bit low. So, yeah. Do not like. Alright, be gone. Kaboom! Right. Give me those. Camera, thank you. I'm just gonna ignore you. Nope, nope, nope. Oh man, it looks like another giant wall that we're gonna have to repaint. Wait a tick. It's a giant coin! We're rich! Well, we would be if we could actually pocket a coin that big. And if it weren't completely drained of color. Never mind, Mario. Sorry, get your hopes up. We're not rich. At least you got friendship. Which I do. Shut up. <laughs> we can paint this. We got to have us to do it. We, we can do... Oh, I love how it's already like golden when it's painted. Dude, I get it. I want the Mega Coin just as much as you do. But some things are just not meant to be. And I hate to see you waste all of your yellow paint like this. 
No, we, we can do this. Like, we're making a good head start. I think it's possible. Like, just, again, give me a step ladder or something. Still have got the gold, Fever Mario. Snap out of it. Let's go get some regular size coins and take your mind off this monstrosity. <laughs> oh, I can't wait until this is painted after a yellow chapter. That's gonna be a hoot and a half. Well, whatever. Can I... Yeah! That's annoying. Well, whatever. Ah, oh, yes. And that. And that. Ooh, not a hammer. Cool. Eh? Ah, oh, you sad little Goomba. Let's make you a sad huge Goomba, yeah! That's quite a roadblock, isn't it? Whoa, Mario, did you see that? Never mind, I saw it and... Uh, thank you, Hilly. That weird nearsighted guy just inflated that Goomba. Maybe he's the one making everything big! Including my voice! <laughs> okay. Kick his ass! Been there, done that. Got a t-shirt. Right, maybe if I use two big hammers and get an excellent on both of them, that will do it? Let's see. Good start, loving it. Yeah, that should be more than enough. Cool. So that's how you do it. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, look at that. Yay, a big jump. I feel like another new type of big card would have been cool on that secret spot, but whatever. I'm not here to complain. Actually, I'm here to complain, obviously, but it's fine. Could be worse. Not a big e camera, that's nice. Uh, uh, that's a weird spot for that. I don't know. It feels like there could be something in there, but I don't think there is, so whatever. It's fine. Anything hidden behind you, though? No. Well, fine. That's a big one. Cool. That. Cool. And we've made it to our goal. Hmm, what's this? Some kind of chain, maybe? I wonder if the professor dropped it. Hey, dude. Hey, uh, sorry to bother you while you're softly crying to yourself, but would you happen to be the professor? You see, we're looking for the professor of super old things. I am indeed the professor of super old things, but I've suffered a great tragedy. My poor little princess is missing. That's her chain over there. I hope you're safe and sound, my sweet little baby, wherever you are. Yeah, I wish we could help, but we're kinda busy searching for the pain stars. Does she know the way home? Maybe she just went back home. Of course! She's probably waiting for me at home! My princess is as smart as she is cute. She would have known just what to do. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm off. Oh, I can't wait to see the look on her sweet little face. Daddy's coming, princess! God, I hate how language has changed. Well, he cheated up quickly. No. <laughs> no one's calling me now. I'm sure Prince is waiting for him at home. For all of our sakes. Yeah, that would be good, wouldn't it? A uh, couple more coins leading the way. And that's that stage. Might be a bit of a difficulty curve for some, but I do like the idea, and it's a visually cool stage as well. So, yeah. Gets a thumb up, thumbs up from me. Wait. Now next time on Paper Mario Color Splash, we're gonna 
head back to the chateau and see if the professor has found his princess. Who knows? Till then, see ya!